This program is about your role as a fire warden. What you need to know to help ensure that your premises is evacuated quickly and efficiently. And how you can help ensure that a fire doesn't start at your workplace. Everyone in your organisation should have been trained in the procedures to be followed if a fire were to break out. Before taking any other action, everyone should know that if they discover a fire, they must raise the alarm. Regardless of the type of fire alarm, if it activates and a constant alarm can be heard, anyone without a specific duty should begin to evacuate using the nearest available fire exit. Fire wardens will normally be responsible for checking areas which are near to their desk or workplace and realistically should take no more than one minute to check their designated area. All areas should be checked thoroughly and must include toilets, stock rooms or areas which are not normally visited. Once the search has been completed, go to the assembly point and remember to tell the person in charge about any room that has not been searched. Your role in the day-to-day -day fire safety of the company or organisation is equally important, as preventing fire is largely common sense and requires no special skills. As part of your normal daily routine, fire escape routes should be checked to ensure they are free from obstructions, and that includes those leading from the building. Fire alarm call points need to be visible and kept free from obstructions at all times. All firefighting equipment should be available and visible and never be used to prop a door open. Arson is a particular problem so any skips, rubbish bins or combustible materials should be stored well away from the building. Most fires occur between the hours of 6 at night and 6 in the morning when everybody has gone home for the day. So make sure that your building is safe from fire or it may end up looking like this.